This video is going to go over how to install the drivers and software for your Photometrics camera. We're going to start off by coming to the Photometrics.com website, going to Support, and then clicking on Software, Drivers, and Downloads. Here you'll be able to select what camera you have and the operating system you're using, and we'll give you a recommendation on the most current driver. So here's a list of all of our legacy and our new Prime 95B camera. Then select what operating system you're using. And we're going to give you the recommended driver. Click here to start an automatic download and install like you would any other software. Okay, now that I've installed their programs, I created shortcut keys for both the RS Config and PV Cam test. So if I open up RS Config, it's going to show me if the camera is connected. Now here you can see it says USB because we're connected with a USB cable. If you were using the PCI cable, that would say PCI. Okay, if your camera is not shown here, um, go ahead and double check it by going to your device manager. Here you can just verify if your computer is detecting the camera. Here we can see PV cam, second generation USB cameras. Okay, now if it is not shown here or on RS config, go ahead and power cycle your camera, turn it off and then back on, and then hopefully it will pop back up. If not, you can also try reinstalling the drivers. Now we're going to open up PV cam test to make sure our camera is operational. Change this snap circle buffer to live circle buffer and go ahead and click start. Okay, great. This is the phone from my camera case and our camera is working. Okay, so now you can hit stop and now that you know your camera is operational, you can close this program and open up any third party software like Micromanager to control your microscope. If you're having any problems connecting your camera and need additional support, come back to our website and click contact. Here you'll be able to fill in your information and your local sales rep or dealer will be able to contact you. You can also click on support and here contact us at our 800 number or you can even fill out an online support request. Here we're going to ask you for your information, how to reach you, information about your camera and system, and then go ahead and fill out any information about your problem. Thanks for watching. Please check out our website for additional tutorials.